Part two of the stream, Scuffed Steve tier list. Here we go. As part of the sub goal, I'm going to do in five minutes, as fast as I can, I'm going to tell you what I think Steve's tier list is in matchups. It'll be real quick. With complete, with complete guessing. All right. What you're about to see here is the most scuffed Steve matchup chart you've ever seen. Click subscribe right now, or I will kill this pup. All right. You ready? Oh, Can't be Omega, thank you. All right. <laughs> this, 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 this should not, this should not be taken with accuracy by any means at all. I'm just, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna make this list, and when the real list comes out, we're gonna see how accurate I was. You guys ready? All right, Bayonetta. Does Bayonetta beat Steve? Um, Bayonetta. Bayonetta. Um, can combo stay at the top? She might have trouble getting in because of the blocks, and I think she's off the stage a lot. You can edge guard her. She's lightweight. I'm gonna say Steve beats her 60 40. Bowser Jr. Uh, uses uses the uh, <laughs> Bowser Jr. has has uh, Koopalings, Mega Koopas, and they can't get along because of the blocks. It's too bad. And of course, when you up B, you can't go to the blocks. So Steve beats him. Steve beats Bowser Jr. Bowser, big boy, um, up side of shield wrecks him. I think Steve beats Bowser. Falcon recovery is ass. Wrecks him. Can't do anything about it. Crom recovery goes through. Big sword, big range. Hurts for Steve. But recovery is equalizes it. 50 50. Uh, Cloud, same thing as, as Krom. Corrin, same thing as Krom and Cloud, except Corrin has a projectile, which is not too bad. Um, so I think it's also probably even. Also, he outranges him a lot. So that's, that's going to hurt. I think Peach destroys. I have a feeling that Peach wrecks uh, Steve. It's like a more oppressive puff. Game Watch a struggle approach. I think Game Watch can struggle versus Steve a little bit. I could actually see Game Watch losing versus Steve. This, this is all this is all scuff, by the way. I'm just I'm just going off literally one day of footage, and and one day of whatever. Uh, Ganondorf. I think Ganondorf's actually e e equal. I think uh, I think all the all the really big heavy hitters that aren't huge. First of all, any huge character like Bowser, DK, Ridley, K. Rule. I think they're all up here. For the sole fact alone that up smash is that oppressive versus them. That's what I think. Who else? Uh, Ridley. But the heavy hitters who are slightly smaller, like Gandorf, Snake, for instance. I think Snake wrecks him. Snake is probably one of his worst matchups. Any character that has projectiles, any character he can't get away from, that's going to hurt him a lot. Um, I think Puff beats Steve. That's my opinion. Kirby, Kirby, probably, Steve probably beats him just by a little bit. Puff without rest. Me Fighters versus Steve, I think Me Fighters probably have a hard time because they have to be, well, Me Brawler has to be in close range, so Me Brawler probably loses slightly. Um, and then, Me Gunner is probably in the same spot as Game & Watch. And I put Me Sword Fighter, all the other swords. Um... I think Rosalina destroys Steve. There's no way. Uh, I think Ike is here too. Actually, no, I, I think Ike beats Steve. Ike is, Ike is a heavy hitter. Uh, Spacey is Fox Falco. Uh, rushdown characters. I think Steve struggles versus all rushdown characters. Uh, and Wolf is like, sometimes rushdown, sometimes can't be, but I, I would put them all here together, to be honest. And they're small targets. Steve does better against big targets, what I'm trying to say. Um, what are the big targets that I miss? Oh, the Shotos. He beats Shotos because of the up B recovery. He's in Bayonetta tier, I think. Again, this is all scuffed. This is all just speculation. Um, Ice Climbers versus Steve. Uh, Ice Climbers can desync a little bit. Steve's kind of light. It's going to hurt. Uh, I'll, I'll cut that even matchup. Incineroar also is in that category, yes. Where's Incineroar? Um, yeah, the buzz also said that Rose is his worst matchup. You can see a trend here, too. Uh, Meta Knight, small, oppressive, rush down. I can see Meta Knight being definitely a nuisance. I'll put him in this tier, too. Um, Pac-Man, same category. I think Rob probably wrecks Steve. But he's kind of big, so he's been in Ike tier. Heavy hitter, big target, but yeah. Um, 
I think the plumber's probably... Luigi has Luigi has the um, the scuffed grab, which is probably going to hurt him a lot. Um, but Luigi, apart from the grab, he needs to get into his face to do stuff. Um, but Luigi also has the combo, which is probably going to come kind of early. I'll probably put plumbers even. Um, Ness and Lucas. Ness now with buffs. I think Ness beats him. Um, plus, you can stay away. You, have to f you force you force you to come in, and when he's trying to run away and get all his all his stuff there, it's probably going to wreck him. Plant is a heavy... Plant is in this tier too, I think. I think actually, no. Plant... Uh, plant Steve. No, actually, Steve can block his recovery. I put him here. Richter and, and Simon. Um, Richter and Simon. They get the recovery wrecked too, don't they? Actually, I think the uppy recovery they can go through. So I'd probably... Probably get rid of... Uh, probably an even matchup. But if they're on stage, it probably hurts. There's a lot. Like, I don't know how... But Steven can probably get around all projectiles with using the blocks. So, it's probably back and forth. I'll put that even. Uh, Pit and Dark Pit. I actually think Steve beats Pit and Dark Pit pretty, pretty soundly, actually. Because they're, they're floating nature like Peach and kind of lightweight, but they don't have the huge, like, assault of hits that they usually do with other characters. i probably put them here softly. Um, Pikachu. Pikachu. I think Pikachu actually beats um, Steve pretty hard. Even 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 with the, um, the up B spam. Or even with the... The blocks, you can put the block Pikachu. Pikachu Pikachu can just spam so many Thunder Jolts. And, and the Buzz was struggling super hard versus Pikachu in the tournament. And that wasn't even like an amazing Pikachu. Same with Pichu. Pichu's actually hard to hit. Palatina, same thing. Although, actually, Palatina... Palatina... The up the, the ledge block probably really, really hurts her. Palatina still might be even, right? Well, no. Losing slightly. Uh... Isabel, I think Isabel will struggle. Isabel will struggle. She doesn't have enough oppressive tools to deal with him. Wario has to get in. He has the bike. He has to get a recovery. But with blocks, he would actually hurt. I'll put Wario even. So yeah, if you're just tuning in, all I'm doing is making a, a, a speculation. My prediction on, on what the matchup guy is going to be. It's completely guessing. But if we get close, it'll be fun. Uh, Diddy Kong... I saw I saw I saw the buzz play Diddy Kong the other day. Uh, Diddy Kong has some pretty good um, banana combos, but in general, when you have blocks that sort of get in the way, it would probably hurt. So I'd probably put it even. Uh, Doctor Mario is like Mario and Luigi is a little bit a little bit easier. Put him there. Uh, Roy and Marth. I'll put all the sorties together too. To be honest, all the sorties are thinking for the day because it's trade off between range and recovery. Joker Steve. I think Joker gives Steve a hard time. Because our Sen. Also, I think that Sheik gives Steve a hard time too. I think Sheik is actually way too fast for him to deal with. And I watched Sharp versus the Buzz, and it just seemed like a very uphill battle. Um, Samus and Dark Samus. Uh, they're floaty. I could see that being slightly even. Actually, I, th I could see Steve beating them, actually. Because they thought it would be recover. They have, they have, they have the... Um, obviously, they have the... Uh, like the Zare to Ledge, which is a good thing. But yeah. Um, that leaves a few left. Uh, Lucas. Same category as Ness, but he has PK Fire to the side. He has a Zare. Um, I think I think it could be kind of even, actually. Uh, Duck Hunt Dog. Duck Hunt Dog is like, you know, they both can control TNT, can control Can. Uh, it might actually hurt him. I think Duck Hunt Dog would actually slightly beat um, Steve because he can use a Can to get around it. And Steve has trouble catching him. Uh, Mewtwo, huge body, floaty, heavy target. I think Steve would actually wreck Mewtwo. Yoshi, uh, same category as like... Yoshi is probably the same category as like Rob and Palatine and Ike. Kind of clunky, but heavy hitter. And that he can't really... Oh, but Yoshi doesn't have... But no, Yoshi can up B3. He can use... Yeah, he can use eggs to up B3 through the, the ledge. Um, Banjo, Steve. I think, I think I could see Steve beating Banjo. Because Banjo, he has Wonder Wing. But if you have blocks there, it could f*** him over. His recovery is adequate, but slow. Um, Little Mac. <laughs> no, it's not, it's not 80-20. I'll put up a Falcon here. Little Mac. Little Mac's by himself up there. Um, Mega Man, same category as the other spammers who kind of keep their distance. 50-50. Greninja, probably same category as... Greninja versus... Greninja's got a lot of speed, so it'd be hard for him to come back. But his up B would get completely scuffed, so probably slightly beats. 
I think Robin actually beats Steve slightly. Uh, Villager, I put along with Isabel. Same category. Uh, Min Min, Byleth. Byleth put 50 50. You know, it's trend here. Uh, if they're kind of heavy with swords, I think Link actually would end up beating um, Steve slightly. Just because he has bombs, do all stuff, and arrows. And Shulk, also 50 50. 50, 50 all the swords there as well. Olimar would be oppressive. Oppressive and small and tiny and a pain in the ass to get around. I think Olimar would actually solidly beat uh, Steve. Sonic is really, really fast, annoying. No matter how many blocks you put down, it still has a problem to deal with. Okay, I could actually see Sonic being down there too, actually. I'll put Sonic in 3070. Um, Lucario, he probably destroys Lucario. That up B has no chance at all. I'll put him up from here. I might put him up here. Uh, we got Young Link also. I think all the links are probably, he loses all the links. We fit trainer, the up B can't do shit to get past. There's a slight hitbox. Uh, probably beats him slightly. Or he beats her slightly. Zero suit Samus is probably really annoying for him. Too much speed. Kind of a Sonic tier. Too much speed. You have, you can grab the ledge. You can do a lot of things. Um, and I'd probably put Terry along with Ryu and Ken, if I'm being honest. But, uh, but Terry, Terry's up B goes through it. So it makes it 50-50. Uh, Hero, again, 50-50. Because it all depends on RNG. He's got a sword too. Can sometimes zoom. Zoom will mitigate all the block traps that you have. Uh, but he has range too, which forces him to come in. Inkling, I'd probably put. Uh, Inkling has a really good back air, but upbeat a ledge will probably get snuffed out by it. Um, but you can probably combo Steve because like Mario's weight probably even as well too. I could see Steve beating Mimit pretty hard actually because Mimit needs to stay on the ground and use her moves. And if there's blocks there, if there's blocks there, it's gonna be a pain in the ass. Zelda can use uh, Phantom Knight and use a lot of projectiles to make him force him to come in. So and that probably goes through everything. Up B probably goes through that as well. And probably dies kind of early from kick. Probably even. And finally, Pokemon Trainer, I could see solidly beating because of the options that you have there. Even if those, there's Let's Traps, you have three ways to get around it. Not to mention kills from Ivysaur, kills from Trainer. Oh, uh, yeah. But yeah, that's my scuffed ass tier list. <laughs> this is a complete prediction. I would love to see how this is going to change over time. Um, so there it is.